Hey guys, it's MonkeyBoy11706 here. Um, Alright, what do you, if you see in front of you, this is a different type of video. See in front of you, it's the Digital Mix Max, the Mac Maker, sorry. It records from radio F to FM to MP3 to USB or SD card. Um, it docks connection for iPhone, iPods, USB and SD card reader. Uh, connects to MP3 and CD players through an aux in 3.5 millimeter, and it has an AM FM radio with stereo speakers. Okay, I found this at the mall. That was last Friday, and I found it. Couldn't find anything, but I, I bought this at. I don't know if you guys have it or not. I got the receipt right here. FYE. Um, it was, it says right there on the box, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it used to be $100, but they rolled it back to 60 bucks. So I said, I, I said, I had to get it, because it cost that much. The grand total when they came out, it was 63.59. But anyway, I already have it outside the box, I told you this is going to be a different video. And, what else on here, oh. Let me show you the back too. Okay. Digital mixer. It has all the same stuff there. Alright, put you back on your Alright. Now here is the device itself. It looks like an old uh, boombox from um 1980, 1970, I'm guessing. 1970, I'm guessing. Um, but you can put batteries in it. Takes, um, I believe, eight D batteries. It takes two AAA for the clock. Yeah, there's a clock in here. There's a clock right here. Anyway, uh, you put your iPhone in here. It goes. Oh yeah, the box that it, it, it supports up to any iPod. I even tried with my iPhone 4 and it works. Uh, but this thing down here, the dock connector moves back and forth for the different models. And there's these things right here. It's here that you can make it small for the old Nano. We're going to press this release button. Go as big as the iPod Classic. But yeah, you put that in there. Um, I, I can't, dem I cannot demonstrate the so uh, music out of here because I don't own the rights for music. But just take my word, it's, I had this up to, it says on the box it goes up to 11, but boy that's loud. I'm not even lying here. But yeah, you can carry it around. Um, find control over here. Record. Modes like different things like on your iPhone or iPod or iPhone, you can switch between tracks and everything. like if you want to repeat the track, repeat it once, or repeat the whole album or shuffle. Uh, rewind, fast forward, pause and stop. I mean, pause and start, and stop for all the modes for SD, USB, and iPhone. Oh yeah, the ports. I'll bring up the videos. The ports are right in there, see? Accelery, SD card, and USB. Alright, put the door back. There we go. Put the door back up. But, um, oh yeah, this is the tuning knob right here. And there's also different settings up there. Up here it says power up. Aux in SD, USB, and iPod in, uh, in in radio. That's on function. And on band, it says FM record, FM station, or AM station. This company's very nice, too. Um, oh, the company's name is... I'm going to butcher so badly. Um, Invo Innovative Technology. Um, digital Mix Maker. And they were so nice, right here. Back here, this is how I got out of the box. Is you 
pull this out. Okay, here's the plug that you plug it in with. Oh yeah, if you have this plugged in wall with this, it will charge your iPod slash iPhone device. And the way I got this is here's a USB extender. Um, and here's a 3.5 to 3.5 millimeter jack. Normally companies don't include this, but I'm glad, I'm happy that they included on this. Um, oh yeah, um, while well, I have this open, right here, that's for the clock, the triple is. I got about two batteries in there, and this is the battery compartment. Um, that's where you put your car, er, and right here, that's where you put your power in. Right there. All right. And the cool thing is, all this stuff goes into the back. There's like this little slot back there. Um, the review on it is pretty dang cool. I'll show you my old speaker system I used to have for my iPod and iPhone. They're made from Logitech's. Oh, this video is just for this device, but I want to show you what my old, why well, I used to listen to see the music through. So that's why I used to listen to music through. It takes four double A's. A lot of people say, oh, that sound, that should be, um, good if you have to use double A's, but it's not that loud. It's loud, but it's not loud. That boombox, on the other hand, I compared them. They're like probably the, this is probably the best sounding by far. I'm, I'm not a big uh, audioist on this stuff, but so far what I had in the past, this is like probably the best sounding I have. But, yeah, but like I said before, I'm not professional on audio or anything. But the front here looks very nice. I'm saying, as soon as I pick that up, oh yeah, this thing has four speakers in it. One right here, one right there, one right here, and one right here. Saying this thing's loud. Alright, um I, I I like it. Pretty cool. Um next video is probably gonna be about a review on my Logitech mouse and keyboard. And um yeah, I got that for my birthday uh, a couple weeks ago. I, I'm probably going to do a review on it. I didn't do an unboxing on it, though, because personal problems in my family. But, uh, so I brought this out instead to do, like, a little review type thing. All right. This is MonkeyBoy1706 signing out. Peace. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, yes, I know I need a haircut. But, um, review on... Uh, on these will come, be coming soon here. This is Logitech EX100 keyboard. And Logitech mouse EX100 desktop wireless thing. But we're going on 8.50 here. Um, I'm just going to say peace. Please uh, rate, comment, and subscribe. Alright, thanks. Bye.